1950, global population was 2.5 billion people, and the 10-year growth rate was 19%. This was because the average fertility throughout the world, the number of children per woman, was 5.0, double what it is today. Average fertility rates varied from region to region throughout the world and from country to country within each region. Population grew very quickly from 1950 to 1970, and by 1970, there were an estimated 3.7 billion people on the planet, with the 10-year growth rate at 20%. By this point, a small decrease in average fertility had occurred, and the average number of children per woman had reached 4.4 throughout the world. This high rate of fertility caused global population to increase rapidly, and by 1990, global population reached 5.3 billion. By this point, the 10-year growth rate had declined to 15%, and the average fertility throughout the world was 3.0 children per woman. The most notable declines in fertility came from Asia and Latin America, where the 1990 fertility was half or almost half what it had been 20 years before. By the year 2011, global population had reached 7 billion people. By this point, the 10-year growth rate had declined, however, to 11%, and the average fertility throughout the world was 2.5 children per woman, which was approaching the replacement fertility of 2.1 children per woman. In some regions of the world, average fertility was actually beneath replacement fertility, such as Europe and Northern America, and in other areas it was close to replacement fertility, such as Latin America, Asia, and Oceania. Thus, during the period of 1950 to 2011, the global population increased from 2.5 billion to 7 billion, a rise unprecedented in human history. During the same time, however, average fertility has dropped from 5 children per woman to 2.5 children per woman, and as this nears the replacement fertility of 2.1 children per woman, we approach the possibility of a stable human population for a more sustainable future.